Haven't you ever seen a hairless squirrel before? Hello, this is Steven. Uh, this is importing image, uh, PNG images, and adding bones to them. Uh, okay. Uh, I have a squirrel here that I ran through GIMP and just erased some uh, background and added an alpha channel. Okay, uh, and there's a squirrel there. Uh, this one leg's a little off. Let's see, I think it's going to be the head. Uh, let's see here. There's the leg. I need to be all the way to the bottom. And I need to move it up a little bit. In fact, these orders are all messed up. Okay, put them in a bone. Oops. Oops. Okay, now. I want to add bones to this. Uh, there's one there. And uh, I could do two bones. I'm just going to go one just for, because it doesn't matter. And then you'll have to go back and uh, click on the first bone and you make one for the tail. And click on the main bone again. One for this foot. Uh, on that again, one for the head, and one for the mouth, and again for the front leg here. Okay, and of course it's gonna—it's not gonna work. It's gonna look like garbage. Okay, and then you just gotta go in there and just uh, bind the layers to the correct bone. Uh, let's see here. Uh, okay, that's that. Bind that layer to that bone. Bind the head to that bone. Bind the mouth to that bone. Bind the Leg to that bone, body here to this bone, leg here to this bone. The reason why I'm hitting invisible to make sure that it's the correct layer. Uh, that bone. Now it should, you should be able to animate it now. Of course, this is the uh, influence that a little bit. I didn't, something's not right here. That tail there is not so. Uh, tail here. Okay. There we go. Oh, now I'm going to grab that leg. <laughs> All right, now it works. Sometimes it didn't accept it like it's supposed to. Okay. There you go.